one of the many uh, interesting rules that we have here. Five, four, three, two, one. Fight, fight robots, robots, fight! Oh, there we go. Potentially going to fail. Having some weapon issues on both of their bots. Ooh. Luma's Weed Whacker's weapon is, well, being quite effective, actually. It's taking these robots all the way across the, the arena when it gives them hits. There you see little chunks taken out of PGF. Luma's Weed Whacker very well driven, as you can see. When you're doing the horizontal bot, what you're really trying to go for is this nice side of the bot hits, where you have kind of weaker armor than what you're expecting in the front. And Luma's Weed Whacker is able to get those just by maneuvering itself around the box appropriately. It One of the things I love about Luma's Weed Whacker is how reliable this robot is. It just keeps going. There we go, Luma's Weed Whacker just grinding away on that front wedge of PGF. PGF was a multi-bot at the beginning of this fight, but we have not seen much of that smaller robot doing anything. It's just spinning over there in the corner, trying to get itself back up. It's a lifter bot. Not doing much lifting, though. Do you even lift, bro? <laughs> now, one of the challenges for Luma's Weed Whacker is going to be trying to get through to those wheels. I mean, they're protected on PGF, and uh, it, it looks right now like PGF is, is basically uh, uh, impenetrable. You know, like uh, this, this match will probably go the full three minutes. Yep, just grinding away on that plastic, taking little bits and chunks out of it, and now it looks like PGF is spinning in a circle. PGF, are you able to show any translational movement? Oh, that is a tap out. All right, PGF taps nice. out Luma's Weed.